Hey, my name is Jesus Castillo, and in this video, you're going to learn how to fix the unitialized constant error in Ruby. If you like Ruby, make sure to subscribe to the channel now so you can keep improving your Ruby skills. Now let's take a look at this error. If I type rand because I want to use the random class, then I get this error. Uninitialize constant rand. Why is this? Well, there are three reasons that you could get this error. Reason number one is that we made a typo. In this case, not run, but random. And uh, Ruby includes this very useful, very helpful um, message that says, did you mean random? Yes, I did. So that's one of the reasons that you want to pay attention to look at your error messages because it might include things like that. So in this case, we have a typo. It's not rand, it's random. Well, or an incomplete name. And we can fix it like that, right? Now the error is gone. So that's reason number one, typos. Reason number two is this. We get unitalized constant set. And notice that there is no, did you mean anything right now? So I don't have a typo, but what I have is a missing dependency. So we're missing, in this case, to require the, the set library. Now I require set and the error is gone. And if you are using Rails, you probably need to add this to your gem file. You open the gem file and you add gem, whatever you need in there, right? That's reason number two, missing dependency, either install the gem or use your gem file or the require in a plain Ruby file like that. So that's the second reason. Let's take a look at the third reason why you might be getting this error. And the third reason is that you might have a class like for example, gear, right? Um, maybe later on in the code, let's say there is a lot of more code right here, right? And you want to use year days. And of course, we get the unity aligns constant year days. And again, no, did you mean anything? Because this is not a typo. So what's happening here? Well, it's very simple. We forgot that we didn't define days. We think we define it, but we forgot to do it. So now I can define it. Three, six, five, and the error goes away. So that's the third reason why you might be getting the initialized constant error. There are only these three reasons. So if you go over them one by one, you will solve your problem resolve your error, you will fix your error. Let's review. Reason number one, typo. Reason number two, you are missing a gem or a require or something like that. You're missing a dependency or you're not requiring it into your project. And reason number three is that you forgot to define your constant. And on this reason number three, let me make a special point. Let me make a note because you might not know. Yes, this is a, yes, this is a constant, but also the class name is a constant, right? So if we forgot to define our class here entirely and we try to use it like this, then we also get the error unitalize constant year. Why? Because the class itself, the class name itself is also a constant. A constant is not only these values like this, it's also the class names. Okay, so that's something for you to remember. 
on point number three. So that's why are you getting this initialized constant error and how to fix it. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please give me a like so I know that you like this video. And if you want to keep learning, visit my website, rubyguides.com and subscribe to the newsletter so I can send you my best content to help you become a great Ruby developer. Thanks a lot for watching. See you in the next video.